Welcome to using Cisco Unified Intelligence Center COIC 11.5. This What's New video is one of a series of videos on the product. In this video we're going to concentrate on a couple of exciting features new to COIC 11.5, namely the favorites and search facilities. Other videos in this series include customizing reports, permalinks, using dashboards, value lists and collections, and understanding users, groups, and permissions. The new look in 11.5 provides a cleaner user interface, making navigation easier, simpler, and more intuitive. Users are now able to search for reports by name, as well as easily creating a list of favorite reports for convenient access. Less learning, more reporting. Let's now take a look at those dynamic search features and the ability to create favorites within CUIC 11.5. Let's start by examining the folder and report structure a customer might already have created. We'll open the reports link and we'll see immediately that our customer has created a custom reports folder. That custom reports folder contains a subfolder, sales, and in that sales folder, further folders for sales central, sales east, and sales west. If we open up either of those folders, we see that there are a couple of reports for sales central agents and service level central. Let's then go back to the home page and see how we might use the search facility to find the reports and or folders that we are interested in. by accessing the search box and just simply typing in, for example, West. Those Sales West agent reports and the Sales West folder are immediately displayed. If I search on East, let me get that spelling right. There we go. Uh, Then my sales east folder, sales east agents and service level east reports are also created. Perhaps if I uh, searched on something a little more general, namely service, then not only do I see um, reports in my custom folder, but also all of those service reports in the stock reports as well. So hopefully you can see how uh, easy it is to search that series of reports or those, those report menus to find the reports that we want simply by using that search facility. We can also use this same search facility within the reports themselves. Let's open up our custom reports, sales, the sales central folder, and for argument's sake, we'll go to the service level central report. You'll notice here perhaps that our service level central reports contains objects, call types, way more than just those service level central uh, objects that we want. We could go through each of these painstakingly and select the ones we want, or perhaps if we go to the filter tab, Go to the key criteria. Let's take out all of those objects. And I'll just do a search here in the available values for central. And immediately I see both the collections and individual reports that are referencing sales central. Let's just select the sales central collection. We'll save this as a default filter and click Run. And you can see how easily and conveniently this search feature has provided just those call type objects that we want to report on. 
So that's a quick look at the way in which 11.5 search facility makes it easier to navigate uh, and unearth those reports which might be ho otherwise hiding uh, in the uh, huge list of reports that your company will at some stage probably create. Let's now go back to reports and see how we might use the favourites tool in order to enhance that particular search facility. Let's go back, right back to the reports menu. Now supposing I wanted to look at that sales central service level report on a regular basis. I also find that the agent and agent team reports from the stock reports are going to be accessed regularly. How might I organise it so that I can see those easily and conveniently? Well, let's first go to the custom reports, sales, sales central, find my service level central report and simply click the star over here on the right hand side. Notice that that becomes a favourite. Let me go back to the reports and let's use the search facility here to search for agents. And now I'm seeing the sales central, uh, central east and sales west agents. Let's suppose I don't really want to go there, but I'm looking at the stock reports uh, for these uh, particular agents. So I'll click back to uh, all, go to the stock reports um, and open up my CCE and look at agent. And now, if only I could spell. And now those stock report, agent reports are showing up. The two that I'm interested in are the agent team historical all fields. So let's go to there and let's make that a favourite. And also the agent not ready detail. For example, I could make them any of them favourites. And notice that our favourites list has now gone to three. If I were to just click on the favourites, then perhaps as expected, those reports that I'd created as favourites are conveniently listed. So I no longer have to troll or even search through the list of reports to find the ones that I am interested in. If we get uh, to the point where a report is no longer required as a favourite, then to deselect it, it's almost as simple. Simply by coming to the star uh, and deselecting. Deselecting and my favourites have been limited now down to one. So that's a very quick description of the search facility and the favourites uh, facility associated with 11.5. Both of these facilities are designed to make it easier uh, and more convenient and more efficient to navigate the product. Make sure you check out the remaining videos in this series. Thank you for watching.